I am at Dollar General. Not the one you're thinking of. A different one. This is the one where that guy scared the living life out of me. That kind of happens a lot. Uh, let's see if there's anything in there. <laughs> yeah, baby. Let's get in there. See you at home. Hello, dumpsterinos and frugalistas. All right, what do we have? What do we have? This would have been nice, except it would be all melted, but Edie's pie. Oh, God, don't you love those? Those like old fashioned good humor. So those are the best, but they're not in there. We got a bottle, a baby bottle. We don't have a top. Maybe there's a top in there, but you know, baby can hold. La, 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 la. We got a lot of garbage in the garbage here. Here is a bottle of water that has not been opened yet, so that's nice to have. It's good to have those in the car, um, you know, if you want to wash your hands because you didn't wear gloves during your dumpster driving. Got a lot of uh, empty, empty, uh, this is yucky. Oh God, I don't even know what that is. It's like somebody's peanut butter and jelly sandwich is stuck to the outside of the Dawn. This is Dawn dish soap. It's down to here, but that's still a good amount of soap. Dawn is, look, I mean, they, they clean baby ducks with it. it. This is good soap. It suds. I like a soap that suds. So we'll put that into a different container. Uh, we've got a bottle of Sunny D, January 10th, 23 date. Not my favorite beverage, but we've got that. You know, I think a lot of this, oh, good Lord, a lot of this garbage got rained on because a lot of, there's a lot of wetness in here. We've got a can, full can, not even dented, of Seagram's ginger ale. Very nice to have on hand for in case somebody gets sick. <laughs> there goes one of the frugal babies. We never saw her. She was one with the wall. 
Uh, someone opened up a bag of mini marshmallows because they are all over the place in here. Oh, this is like kind of nasty trash. Oh, here's another Seagram ginger ale. This one is a little bit dented, but good to have. Good to have. Because you know people always get sick late at night on a Sunday, right? When you, you, even if you wanted to go out into the thunderstorm to buy ginger ale for somebody who's not feeling well, like then the stores are all closed. Got a lot of like half, half drunk drinks. We have a rogue granola bar, sweet and salty almond flavor. Those are yummy, I've had those. There's another one of them. Oh, this is a different kind. This is Quaker Chewy dark chocolate. Little granola bar. Nice to have for emergency food. They're not in their original box. Somebody enjoyed some Skittles. Oh, they're still in there. You know why? Because it was on one of those, um, you know, the rack things where it has the pokey thing and they're hanging from it. And it ripped from the hole where it's hanging up to the top. So they're probably like, oh, we can't sell it. But it isn't open. It didn't rip down into the bag. It's still sealed. Skittles. Of so much like Dawn and jelly on my fingers now. That's what you get for not wearing gloves. Don't complain to us about having Dawn and jelly on you. We have a little Gerber packet. Oatmeal banana strawberry cereal. Cereal on the go. I guess you just add hot water, boiling water. I don't know. Got a lot. What is this? What is this? Oh, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. I never, ever buy these because I just don't feel like these are a great deal, but I'm happy to have it. Deli style tuna salad. Tuna creations in a packet. Best if, you got to get this date. Best if used by June 9th, 2025. Good for the prepper pantry. Yay. It's kind of yucky in here. Ooh, 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 what's that? Ooh, 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 ooh. A, lot of, a lot of wet cardboard is what I'm seeing. Oh, look at this. This is not open or anything. We have a strawberry flavored protein power uh, Nestle Nesquik strawberry fakey beverage. All right, enough from that bag. That was yucky. Let's get to this bag. Wait, what's underneath? Underneath the yucky bag, we have Ritz crackers open. One beautiful, untainted sleeve of name brand Ritz. Totally yummy. We have um, a big sponge for, you know, for mopping. Nice, nice, nice. Very handy also. Ooh, look at this. This is good. Odo Ban eliminates odors. These are full. It doesn't have its little spray nozzle thing. Neither one of them do, but Frugal Daddy keeps those for finding things like this. We've got fabric disinfectant and Odo Ban eliminates odors, disinfectant, fabric, and air freshener. Good. That is good. Very, very good. Very, very good. Very good. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Look at this. I almost just thought, ooh, no, there's nothing there. So we have this damaged, banged up, cheese it, extra cheesy cracker box. And look who's all happy and fine inside, the untainted bag. They're not even all crushed. Now, if they were all crushed, you would use them when you're making your, you know, homemade macaroni and cheese casserole. You'd sprinkle the little crushed one. In fact, I might just, like, crush them up and do it. But, you know, sprinkle them on top of your macaroni and cheese, and it gives it that nice, like, crispy, better than breadcrumbs because you got the cheese flavor. All right, now we get into this bag. This is a pretty good haul. Isn't this a fab video? Aren't you guys having fun? I know I am. All righty, what do we have? Brownie King, eight individually wrapped brownies. They're not all in here, let's see. I think there's like two. Oh no, they're little. We have five of them, five. They're like little mini cupcakes. Um, five of the little individually wrapped brownies. Nice, little treat on the go. We have got paper plates that somehow got opened and one of them came out. Designer paper plates. I'm sure we can find a use for those. Uh, 
Oh my goodness, what on earth is that? I knew something smelled weird in here. I was like, oh, something doesn't smell right in there. And it, now that I see what it is, I know it's not something that went bad. It's just the smell of it. It's like, um, you know, like cheese in a can, like spray cheese. It's, it's like all over stuff in here. It's like, ew, you want to see it? Like, look, this would, be a, this would be a little bottle of lime juice. And it's got like the gooey cheese. That's what it, yeah, that's what smells. I can wash that off, though. I mean, it's gross, but I can wash it off. Put it on that piece of plastic for the moment. Blech. Speaking of cheese, we have Lakeview cheese, a little block of mild cheddar. This is a very thin block. You know, they make it look like it's the size of um, probably an eight-ouncer, but it is thin, and it is four ounces. Oh, these are open. Too bad. Veggie straw, sea salt, already open. We have a bunch of these individually wrapped, you know, like little strawberry cookie wafers. Several of those. Oh, we could put them in this little container. There we go, since we don't have the right box. All right, so we have this little plastic gingerbread guy action going on here. And we'll put the pink wafer cookies in there. Oh, here's another crushed lime juice. How can it be that crushed and nothing's coming out, you know? Like, they must have a lot of extra space in there, but another little lime. Oh, that cheese smell is just kind of ominous. We have a pumpkin spice iced latte. Some more of these little strawberry deals. I'm trying to get the ones out that don't have cheese goobed all over the outside of them. We got some of those. Uh, there's another one. Oh, there's two more. Wait, there's those, those, all these strawberry things. And then a couple more of the limes. Oh, see, now that one is dripping. Oh yeah, you're dripping. Clean the cheese off my hands. I like the smell of lime. Nice citrus smell. Is the other one leaking? That. Another one of those. Okay, so we've got all of those pinkies. And oh, a nail file. It's not one of those metal nail files. I kind of hate these. They kind of like that noise they make, but it's still good to have. And practice your knife throwing with it. I was thinking, you know, you bake it into a cake and bring it to somebody in prison. So that's fun. And another. Lime. Yeah, that one's not looking so interesting. Now, we've also got a full package of Imperial Margarine that was in the bottom of the bin. All right, now for the box. Hostess Orange Cupcakes, not crushed, not opened, not nothing. Are we past the date or something? Like, why would you throw this away? Where is the Best Buy date? Oh, yeah, it's uh, three days. Three days past the Best Buy date. I don't care. Something like that. When it's made by Hostess, this is going to last forever. Oh, the baby bunt cakes. We've gotten these before. These were a hit, I have to say. Oh, we've got several of these strawberry cheesecake bunt cakes. Who doesn't love a bunt? Little baby bunts. All right, that's that down and then we've got more of the orange cupcakes they have the classic hostess swirl on top that they have on their chocolate cupcakes and it's cream filled but orange flavored i think that would be a really delightful the little citrusy cake for a tea party these are all orange there's a lot of these wow definitely giving a bunch of these away more orange more strawberry Another strawberry bunt and another cinnamon bunt. It's a lot. How many all together? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Wow. Twelve boxes of these little hostess cakes. What else is in the box? You want to see in the box? There you go. That was your little sneak preview. We have got a candle. I think this probably was in uh, glass, and it no longer is, which is fine. I don't have to peel the broken glass off. More of the Quaker Chewy Granola Bars. 
We have a uh, flea collar, dual action flea and tick collar for cats. I have never had success with those. I have never found that those worked at all. There's another one. Oh, another one. I guess they knew we have a lot of cats here. Everybody's getting a flea collar. I don't, I don't, well, one, I don't like them because I don't think they work. And two, I, I, I don't like them because they have a weird smell. Like it's, well, this has spice scent. I've never smelled the spice scent. They used to have this weird, um, like a weird minty smell, actually, that I never cared for. Looks like we had a six pack of the little apple juices. We've got three of them now. That's totally cool. We've got several of these little balls. Oh, Liesl wants a ball. You pop this in five seconds, Liesl. And these are small. This is just a little bite for you. Want the ball? Here, can you catch it? Can you catch it? Oh. She didn't catch it, and it fell on top of the cat's head and bounced off of her. Here, take the ball if you want it. She's like, no, it's not clean. It's from a dumpster. I don't want it. More balls, all these little rubber balls. You can always find something to do with balls. Oh, this is a fun one. This is hard. That's not squishy. You can't pop it. She's being picky. Oh, look. This is like a little, um, it's a little squishy fit, fit ball. It's a fit ball. Or as some people call it, a football. Oh, it says splash toy. It's for the pool. Oh, check it out. Good and plenty. Yeah, 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 yeah. If you're not familiar with this candy from way back when, it's licorice. It's a black licorice coated in a sugary candy shell. There was a period of time where I kind of liked these. The idea of them now repulses me. Sorry, it does. Oh, here, look. There's the case that the Chewy Dips things came in. Not the case, but I mean box. And there's three more of those. A couple more cat collars. Another splash toy. Oops. And light bulbs. Oh, you can't see it because of the glare. Halogen light bulbs. Four of them. No, three of them. Three out of four. And they're not broken. They're fine. So that's cool. All right. That's a cool haul. I hope you all enjoyed seeing it. Thank you for watching. Have a great day. See you in the dumpster. Bye-bye.